we go. I have to shoot this fast because of copyright, the song. But look, there's Blu-rays at Goodwill this week. Yay! Here we are at our weekly visit to Goodwill. Seeing you Tuesday, discount day. So blue, we gotta go fast. The music's on. Um, let's do this. Aloha, Nui Loa. Greetings to my new subscribers. Thank you very much. And <clears throat> welcome back, Goy Hunter Ohana. Yes. Well, before we start this video, um, I might not be up to my chipper self because um, <clears throat> one of our cats got out of the house and it's been missing for three days and it's been 100 degrees and we live out in a new suburb. So our backyard is mountains and canyons and We've been out looking for the cat between 2 and 6 a.m. for the past two nights, so I haven't had much sleep. And I'm not making an excuse. I'm just explaining why I might not be that energetic. But production must go on. And I... <clears throat> excuse me. And I... <clears throat> oh, sorry. And um, this is going to be a Goodwill haul that I've been holding. So just bear with me today. It is going to be a long one. Oof. And so grab a snack. Oh, that was too fast. A drink. Sit back and enjoy. And again, I apologize if I'm not that energetic today because I'm very concerned. Okay, uh, first off, I want to thank Melissa and Larry. Oh, <clears throat> uh, they're um, there. You probably know them as MI Dollar Tree DVD. Um, they're so sweet. They made these little decals. Can you see it? It says DVD and Blu ray hunting and trading club. And they even gave instructions of how to place a decal. And they wrote a little note. Um, it says, Hi, Marianne. I hope all is well. We made these stickers for everyone. We just wanted to say thanks for all you do. We really enjoy your videos. It really helps to know what is available. Just wanted to let you know we appreciate your friendship. And thanks for picking up my newspaper. Um... Take care, Larry and Melissa. Again, a shout out to MI Dollar Tree DVD. Uh, they have a web... Um, I believe they have a channel. And if you go to Instagram, you can find them. And they go to so many Dollar Trees and they always buy extras uh, for people who can't get them. And I believe they trade and sell. Again, thank you so much, Larry and Melissa. Yay! Okay. Okay. So, again, it's going to be long. So, enjoy it. And please try and stick it out to the end. Because your support is so important to the channel. Okay, let's start. Okay, this. I... Didn't watch this series when it was on, but I found four seasons. Yes, wait, is this the fourth of Ugly Betty? Look at that. The first season. It's, ooh, sorry. Here's the back. Uh, this is the ABC release. And the first season is, these are the DVD versions, comes with that, and it opens up. And all the discs were in good condition. I believe they weren't scratched. So this is season one. 
I wasn't going to get all the seasons, but then I decided I might as well get it. I think it's someone who worked on production because it's in such great condition. Then Ugly Betty Season 2, still in the shrink wrap, factory sealed. So I grabbed that one also. Then Season 3, factory sealed, Ugly Betty. Here is the back. All at this Goodwill, right by my house. And then the fourth and final season of Ugly Betty. Let's see if I can get this one out. Oh, it's just, it's just a slip cover. There you go. It's the same artwork. And that was a find. Four scenes as an Ugly Betty. Yeah, okay. Then I found something interesting. I thought it was kind of funny. It's presidential bloopers. Factory seal. I see Reagan, Clinton, and oh boy, I'm so bad with history. I don't know who the gentleman is in the middle. You can comment if you want to tell me. Here's the back. Uh, this is a Time Life video. And it says, the American president, powerful, influential, well-respected, and sometimes all too human. Laugh along with the presidents as they laugh at themselves in this celebration of the funniest and most down-to-earth moments of the American presidency. Oh, this was 1999. Presidential bloopers. That's a keeper. Uh, then, I wanted to add this to my collection since I haven't seen it. Factory sealed, Sesame Street, being green. I thought that was cute. It has a bonus Easter puzzle inside. Here is the back. Uh, this is a Warner Brothers release. Elmo and, and Abby find out it can be easy being green when they stumble upon the Earth-a-thon hosted by Mr. Earth, Paul Rudd, happening right on Sesame Street. Oh, this is a cute one, being green. Speaking of staying green, I found this factory sealed Jim Carrey, Dr. Seuss, How the Grinch Stole Christmas. Look at that, baby. Still with the green theme. And in this hot neon green, lime green. And this was a, let's see, universal release. An instant Christmas classic. The classic celebration of the spirit of the holidays come home. Acclaimed director Ron Howard and longtime producer Brian Grazer plus Jim Carrey. Dr. Seuss's How the Grinch Stole Christmas. I really enjoyed this version. Yeah, but that suit that he had to wear, whoa. I heard it was so hot and hard to get into. Okay, so I went to a Goodwill and I don't think I shot shot it because I ran in and out. It was so hot. But I saw this interesting movie, Control. And it had a slip cover. And that was the back. And it's um, a Weinstein company. And I looked it up. And it was worth a little more than I spent. So I was excited. I don't know if it's out of print or um, low in production. And let's see. Let's see the DVD disc. Oh, it has a nice picture right there. So the reason why this was so special, and it wasn't, it's in good condition, not scratch, the disc itself. See, this is... Um, Based on his wife's memoirs, Control con follows Curtis humble Manchester origins, his rapid rise to fame, tormented battle with epilepsy and struggles with love that led to his death at the age of 23. Wow. Uh, this stars Sam <clears throat> Riley, an acclaimed breakout performance, and Samantha Morton as his teenage bride. I look at a gifted musician. So I was so elated to find this control. 
about that um, the tragic tale of the singer of Joy Division. I have no idea who that is or what that is. So, But I had a gut feeling that was a good DVD to pick up. I also found 21, 21 Days to Baghdad, National Geographic, Nat Geo, uh, the inside story of the military campaign to topple Saddam Hussein in a snapper case and still factory seal. And a portion of the proceeds will benefit families who have lost loved ones serving the U.S. military. Maybe, I don't know if it's going to help now because this is old. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Uh, take a comprehensive look at the extraordinary military campaign dubbed Operation uh, Iraq Freedom. Take National Geographic takes you to the front lines of the war in Iraq. Discover the inside story between the high-tech, high-speed war like no other. 21 Days to Baghdad. That was good. that looked like a good one. And of course, it's Nat Geo. Then I found this factory sealed, R. Nixon. Who isn't fascinated by that, President Nixon? Here is the back. In um, college, I took a political science course, and he was a big topic. This is a Cynodig release. And throughout Richard Nixon's presidency, three of his top White House aides documented their experiences with Super 8 movie camera cameras. Young, idealistic, and dedicated, they had no idea that a few years later they'd be at the center of a history-making impeachment scandal. Wow. This sounds great. A good documentary. R. Nixon. Very interesting fella. And then I found this DVD. Uh, it was a little expensive. I kept the price on it. Hold on. It. But since it's, uh, you know, I take off the prices if it's in a slipcover because I don't want it to peel. I believe this was five ninety nine. Yep. Yeah. It is Never Go Back, Jack Reacher. Here's the back, and this is a Paramount Studios. But this do um, this dollar, this was a special edition. See, it has a booklet. Lee Childs, everyone, everyone talks, and here is the back. And what this Goodwill is in located next to the studios. A lot of the like Warner Brothers Universal. So there were seven copies of this so I figured they were doing some cleaning spring cleaning and they just donated all these weird these copies of Jack Reacher never go back so that um, booklet I saw it's an illustrated short story so I figured I better pick this baby up because it looks very special then Wow I found Game of Thrones Blu-ray. Game of Thrones Blu-ray, the whole second season. Oh, there's nothing in the back, sorry. Wow. Beautiful slipcover. And it came with, this is a DVD digital copies. It's a little smudgy there. And then here are all the Blu rays. It's all in a fold out. Bam. 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 And he, ooh, let me do it this way. There you go. I did the opposite way. Let me fold this back. And it came with some. Um, uh, just some HBO stuff, but the discs were in terrific. I think some of most of them are mint condition. So who wouldn't have grabbed this Game of Thrones season, the complete season two, 
Blu-ray for $4.99 at that same, um, the same Goodwill by the studios. Wow, what a deal. Then I found this oldie but goodie, Michelle Pfeiffer, George Clooney, factory sealed one fine day. I didn't have this in my collection. I don't know if it, there's a Blu-ray. Oh, look, they wrote their initial there. A clever and funny and it's fresh. In this charming romantic comedy, three-time Academy Award winner, nominee Michelle Pfeiffer and ER star, wow, ER star. He didn't even make Ocean Eleven yet. George Clooney find that opposites attract whether they like it or not. Huh. It's a 20th Century Fox release. I don't know if this is the original release. Let's see. I can, let's look at the date. If they have it. Oh, boy. I, I think it's too tiny for me to read, but it looks like an original release. Then I'm not sure if they already had this at the Dollar Tree, but I picked it up anyway, just in case. It is Piggy Tales, the complete second season from the Angry Bird series. Factory Seal. Here is the back. And this was a, oh, let's see, a Rovio release. And it says, uh, new to DVD, caution, pigs at work. Go on the job with the well-meaning but absent-minded working pigs of Angry Birds and find out how Pig City is constructed and deconstructed. Huh. So, I'm not familiar with this at all, but I picked it up. Piggy Tales. Now, this is a gem. Robert De Niro, Robin Williams, Awakening. Look at that. Factory sealed still. I grabbed that puppy up. It's based on a true story. There's no such thing as a simple miracle. Here is the back. I don't know if this is on Blu-ray. Let's see. De Niro gives one of the most dynamic performances of his powerhouse career. Uh, this is a Columbia Pictures. This is, ooh, this is a 1990, the original. Academy Award winning Robert De Niro and Academy Award winner Robin Williams give the finest performances of their career in this inspiring, heart-wrenching and true story about a maverick doctor who awakens his catatonic patients after decades of darkness. Wow, Penny Marshall was also involved in this production and she directed it. Wow, I don't know if you guys are young enough I mean, old enough to remember this. Awakenings. Great movie. I was tickled pink to find this. Hairspray with John Travolta, dressed as the mom. Michelle Pfeiffer. Christopher Walken. A young Zac Efron. Here is the back. And it came factory sealed. Yes, folks. Factory sealed with a slipcover, but I, I really need to take this off because I'm so scared it's going to peel off the um, imaging from the cardboard. So this is the, I don't know which version, how many, there's several versions of hairspray and oh, it doesn't say anything. I guess they assume that we'll know. This is a New Line Home Entertainment Distribution. Hairspray. Yeah. Oh, these are. this is one of my favorite films. I love this film. The Guilt Trip. Barbara Streisand and Seth Rogen. Made me tear a little. Here is the back. <clears throat> this is a... Let's see, it should be, yeah, it's a Paramount release. And Barbara Streisand and Seth Rogen are the perfect com com comedy duo as they embark on one mother of a road trip. The plan for a quick stop at mom takes a turn for the unexpected when an, um, 
Impulse compels Andy to invite his mother on an eight-day, 3,000-mile journey across the country. Oh, this is a... I really enjoyed this movie. It is adorable. Especially uh, the part when she is in Texas and she takes the challenge of eating this huge steak. You know those contests that they have in steak steakhouses in Texas? I don't know if it's a stereotype, but it's adorable. She made me so hungry. Guilt trip. I love it. I love it. Now this, I found it very interesting because of the cover. Um, Factory Seal is the Pretender Movie Edition. Look at that interesting cover. They put it on top, so I don't know what the real cover looks like. Here is the back. It's a 20th Century Fox release. And includes the first two episodes from season one. Uh, action, comedy, drama, suspense. If you like like it on TV, you'll love it on DVD. And now it's here your chance to try out your favorite shows. Oh, sorry. That's not a synopsis. So this has the pilot, episode one, and then episode two. I thought it was a movie. 1996, but this is a 2005 reprint. Uh, let's see. The Pretender, it's, the pilot says Ger Gerard, or Jared, a man who can assume anyone's identity, escapes from a corporation intent on exploiting his genius for their own gain. Huh. That's why he's a pretender. Interesting. Whoa. I don't know how many times I found this, but this one's factory seal, special edition. Platoon. Yes. Here is the back. Uh, of course, you know Oliver Stone. Uh, this is an MGM release, 1986. Winner of four Academy Awards. Chris Taylor, which is Charlie Sheen, is a young, naive American who, upon his arrival in Vietnam, quickly discovers that he must do battle not only with the Viet Cong, but also with the gnawing fear, physical exhaustion, and intense anger growing within him. Oh, remember Tom Berenger in this? He was such a bad guy. I mean, bad character. Platoon. Wow. And then... Bam! I, I couldn't believe I found this. Olympi Olympus has fallen. Gerald Butler, Morgan Freeman, Aaron Eckhart from the Directors of Training Day. And look at that. It comes with the digital code, a DVD, and the Blu-ray. So you'll probably be seeing this repackaged in a giveaway. And um, this is a Sony release. Yeah, I'm going to have to repackage it. It is ripped. The cover right there. I never would give you guys a ripped cover. No. When the president, when the White House is captured and the president is kidnapped by a terrorist mastermind disgraced former presidential guard, Mike Banning moves into action. Oh, I love this. I love this series. Gerald Butler. Wow. I could not believe someone donated this. 12 Years a Slave. 20th Century Fox release. Here is the back. Well, I was happy because it was my game. It comes with a digital code and the Blu-ray. So I was excited. If I don't... I, th I think I already have this. If I don't, this is going to be in one of the giveaways soon. From the acclaimed director Steve McQueen comes this deeply brilliant acted film. It is 1841 and Northup, an accomplished free citizen of New York, is kidnapped and sold into slavery. Stripped of his identity and deprived of his dignity, Northrop 
is ultimately purchased by a ruthless plantation owner, Edwin Epps, which is, which is played by Michael Fassbender, and must find the strength within to survive. Whoa, this movie is... Oh, I don't know. I can't even put it into words. 12 Years a Slave, a must. A must for everybody's collection. Then I was happy to find this. Frozen. Frozen with the slipcover. And look at this. It came with everything. The code, the DVD, and Blu-ray in good condition. So I gotta have to repackage this because the it's not snapping right. So you'll be seeing this very soon in a giveaway. Factory sealed Jane Eyre with Michael Fassbender, my favorite, and Mia Wasowski. Oh, I'm going to kill. Sorry. Here's the back. Uh, this is a universal release. A classic for a new generation. Let's see. Uh, directed by Carrie Fugi Fuka Fugagawa? Oh, I think I'm killing his name. Uh, let's see. A daring new adaption to the timeless romance. When orphaned governess Jane Eyre arrives at an imposing Thornfield Hall, she's intrigued by her bro brooding wealthy employer, Rochester. His dark moods and strange occurrences in the house theater to discover a terrible secret that he had hoped to hide from her forever. Oh, I just noticed something. Even, it, it is some um, factory seal, but they cut the barcode. Oh. I hope you don't mind if this isn't a giveaway. Because I'm not going to open the, break the seal. Hmm, sorry about that. Oh, I was so happy. I found the first season of Modern Family. The entire season. Here is the back. And it was in good condition. Every disc had a different photo on it. So for all you modern families, found this baby out there. I couldn't believe I found this at a Goodwill network. Look at that. Wow. Faye Dunaway. William Holden, Peter Finch, Robert Duvall, a young one. I remember this from my childhood. Let's see. Yeah, there you go. They, let's see. Still mad as hell. This is a Warner Brothers release. Newscaster Howard Beale has a message for those who package reports of cute puppies, movie premieres, and t fender benders as hard news. I'm mad as hell. And I'm not going to take this anymore. I don't... Oh boy. I saw this so long ago. So there's a special features. The making of... Network. A six part documentary. Commentary. By Sydney. Lummet. The director. Network. Classic film. Every film buff should have it. I thought this was so unusual to find this. I was so excited. Walt Disney Pictures presents Sacred Planet. Sacred Planet. Here is the back. Uh, this celebrating our planet. Narrated by Robert Redford. Sacred Planet is a journey away from the hectic world we live in. Uh, through stunning cinematography, it transports you from some of the most fascinating, ex ex exotic, and remote sites on Earth. Uh, this was... A, oh, boy. I can't see the date. Sorry. Let's see what the disc looks like. Oh, cute disc. It has a photo. And it has a J card. Yeah. So... 
I snatched this puppy up. Walt Disney presents Sacred Planet. And then for my Scooby-Doo collection, Scooby-Doo and the Reluctant Werewolf. I don't think I have this one. Here is the back. It's a Warner Brothers clue. It's, and it's a snapper case. Beautiful artwork. Look at that. How cute. So that was a good find. Uh, let's see. It's Scooby-Doo most fan fantastic mystery ever. Uh, they travel to Transylvania in order to enter a monster car race. How cute. It looks like Shaggy turns into a werewolf. Oh, he does. Look at that. So, another for my Scooby-Doo collection. How many of you remember the Velveteen Rabbit? Oh, classic. I found the DVD narrated by Merle Streep. Look at that. I couldn't. Ah, oh. I already repackaged the other DVD case was awful. Here is the back. Oh, it's just a plain disc. And let me see if there was any scratches on this disc. Mint. Wow. I I don't know. People don't realize this is such a classic, great tale. It's Everyone should have it. Let's see. Enchanting story about a toy rabbit. This is first published in 1922. Will live forever in the children's literature. Oh, boy. The Velveteen Rabbit. Yeah, I remember to read that. And then I found this to add to my collection since they've been showing up at Dollar Trees and I started collecting them. Monster High. Monster High. It's a double feature. Fright on and escape from Skull Shores. Here is the back. Uh, this is a universal release. And here's the two little Blu-ray discs. This will go into the Monster High collection. Wow. This was a bit pricey. It was $7.99. But look what it is. Turner Classic Movies. Humphrey Bogart. Four of them. Look at that. Um, the Petrified Forest. High Sierra. The Amazing Dr. Clitterhouse. All through the night, factory sealed, and you can see the seven ninety nine. But I decided to buy it; it's worth it. And then, right next to it, James Cagney, greatest gangster films: City of Conquest, G Men, Every Dawn I Die, and White Heat. Wow! I had to grab this baby. This one's seven ninety nine too, but. What a deal. I never saw this. Um, this was both released for, through Turner Productions. Great find. Oh, I love the old Madonna. Yes, I was there at the beginning. I, I wish I, I don't have it. I used to dress like Madonna. I would I had the perm, I had the glove. I found Madonna Celebration, the video collection. Look at all of the videos on this. I mean, it's not the greatest um, quality, but it's very nostalgic. So it comes with two DVDs, different artwork. Oh, I already played this. You I mean, you can just put it on and leave it on for the background. Madonna Celebration. Excellent. Ooh, this movie makes me vomit. Sorry, that's a little gross. But I grabbed it because I've never seen it. This is the IFC Midnight Unrated Director's Cut. The Human Centipede 2. I saw the first one. I didn't even want to see the second one. But I'm going to pick this up. It's the full sequence. Uh, here's the back. 
just making me, just touching it grosses me out. Here is the artwork on the Blu-ray. Oh, I'm losing my appetite. Let's see. Uh, this is IFC Midnight and Six Entertainment Com The grossest movie ever made. Oh, that, they even admit it. But also kind of likable and charming. Uh, the wait is over for the most controversial movie of the year. The Human Centipede 2 full sequence. To follow up the original cult classic. Uh, it's a 12 person Human Centipede. That's all I got. I can read. I'm going to... Oh, it's coming up. I can feel it. But, wow. To find that at a Goodwill, I'm grabbing that. Then I found this beauty. A young Emma Roberts, Zach Galifianakis. It's kind of a funny story. Right, right there, it sold me. I'd never heard of this movie, so I grabbed it. And... Oh, it's just a normal... This is a universal release. Okay, here it is. Let's see. It is an uplifting comedy about finding sanity in the most unlikely places. Sometimes what's in your head isn't as crazy as you think. That's certainly true for Craig, a stressed out teenager who checks himself into a mental health clinic for some time out. He finds an unlikely mentor, Galifianakis. And a potential new romance, Emma Roberts. Oh, this was a focus features, so it must be good. Okay, then I couldn't believe I found in such great condition first, second, and fourth season of Scandal. Wow, and the fourth season is Factory Seal. So here is the first season. What great show. Everyone should know about Scandal. Comes with the two DVDs. And this was a... It looks like it's a Canadian release. Huh. Because I see that little... Um, insignia. From the creator of Grey's Anatomy and Private Practice comes a captivating saga of illicit relationship, unchecked power, and shocking political intrigue. Man, I, this first season is a doozy. I loved it. it. When I saw the first season, it captured me right away. And then here is the second season. Here is the back. And let's see. Oh, there's even more DVDs. One, two, three, four, five. Wow. So this is the second season of Scandal. I think this person must have put out his whole collection. And this is the complete fourth season. Here's the back. And it's factory sealed, so we can't open it, but we can look at it. Excellent. So I snatched those puppies up fast because these won't last. And I don't know what the price was because I took this, the sticker off. Now, this is an upgrade. At the, a couple of Dollar Tree drops before we found the DVD. Now I found the Blu-ray. A late quartet. So lucky. Um, Philip Seymour Hoffman, Catherine Kinnear, Christopher Walken, and the. And here's the back. Hold on, one more. It's. Uh, this was a 20th Century Fox release. It was still factory sealed, but the cellophane was off. So I'm assuming it's still brand new. Uh, this is an upgrade again. And last but not least, I found a 3D Blu-ray. Born to be Wild IMAX. Wow. Excited. Here is the back. <clears throat> Anything with animals. It even has the 
digital code in here and it has a regular version oh no it only has a 3d version let's see and a dvd version morgan freeman narrates the documentary adventure born to be wild 3d an inspired story of love dedication and the remarkable bond between humans and animals. Hmm, to watch the three. Oh boy. Wait, this pack also includes a 2D version playable on your standard Blu ray. I didn't see it, did you? Let me get this code out. I just see the DVD version. Huh. Maybe the, oh, I'm all confused. Anyway, sorry about that. Born to be wild. And that, folks, is it. That is what I found at the Goodwills for the past weeks, I believe. Or, and again, some of the Goodwills I didn't film because I ran in and out and I wasn't expecting to find anything because I, I arrived there quite late. So thank you so much for staying for the whole kit and caboodle. I know it's a lot. Oh, it's giveaway time. Let's go get this giveaway. Da 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 da. Yay. So. The, the Blu-ray code, I'm sorry, digital code is black and blue. This is a cop thriller. I love this film. It stars, I can't recall her name. Look it up on IMDb, you'll know, black and blue. The, they had turn, Frank Grillo's in this. Uh, it had twists and turns, and if you like cop films, you'll love this. And then, Factory Seal, Dog Soldiers, Nicholas and Kidman, Trespass, Factory Seal. And this is from my collection to you, Factory Seal, The Mummy, uh, the, the Mummy Tomb of the Dragon Emperor, Emperor. This is the one with Jet Li. And this was in a different case, but I recased it. Only the Brave, and it, I believe, the code, it, it still has a digital code in it. Yay! So hopefully it still works. But you get a double digital code. And then, all factory sealed. Once, a time, once Upon a Time in Venice, cute movie. Black, wa Black Wake, Eric Roberts. Ooh, the Bloodlands Magnet release. Wicked Blood. With Abigail Brislin, Grown Up. And for my collection, Johnny Handsome, Mickey Rourke. Classic film. Okay. Okay. Let's, let's double check if there's the code in here. Because I don't want you to think I'm a liar. Hold on. Let's see. Yeah, the code's in there. Yay. So this one, you get two digital codes. Let me put it back in the cellophane bag, sci-fi. Okay, folks. This is the giveaway. It's a quite interesting mix. As you know, I always try to mix it up. Ooh, this is easy. The password will be blue. Blue. B L U E blue. Now for anyone who is new and doesn't know how to get into the giveaways, it's quite easy. Don't forget, this is free, free, free. You don't have to pay for the shipping, nothing. Number one, you must be a subscriber to this channel. Number two, you must reside in the United States. And number three, you need to watch. And the winner is the blue giveaway um, to find out if you're the lucky winner of this great giveaway. 
Yay. Okay, folks, did we cover everything? Once again, I want to thank um, Larry and Melissa, me, Dollar Tree, me spelled M-I, Dollar Tree DVD. Thank you for sending me that cute little decal. You know me, I'm probably going to keep it because I don't like to use stickers and decals. I'm weird, you know that. And um, we got went through the giveaway. That's it, folks. Um, I think I'm... Am I forgetting anything? I don't think so. It was a pleasure sharing my Goodwill haul with all of you wonderful people. So please like. Like. Like the video, it really helps with the YouTube algorithm. I don't understand. And it helps support me, please. And subscribe, subscribe. Yes, uh, a few more subscriptions, then we can do the 800 giveaway. That's a big giveaway and you all know how I do it up big. Comment below, enter the contest. Write blue. You can don't have to make a sentence. Just blue. And then that makes you eligible. Share the Goy Hunter. Share. Tell everyone to subscribe and like the videos. Please. Please. Smash that notification. Ding a ling a ling. Ding a ling a ling. Bell. So you know when I drop the latest Goy Hunter video. Once again, I appreciate you for staying with me, watching the entire video, because I know there's so many other channels you can watch. And I really mean it. Thank you so much. Goy Hunter out. Arrivederci. Ciao. Avida Zane. Sending that Goy Hunter Ohana love to all of you. Mahalo Nu Iloa. And the Blu ray Bandit. Still want you to be very safe out there since there's that new strain. Is that okay to say? I'm not sure. I don't want to get in trouble. So maybe you should still wear your mask because I still am. I was, I did stop, but then I started again. Bye. Good night, everyone. Thank you for watching.